In North Carolina, we're getting a closer look at how Hurricane Helene changed the landscape of the Blue Ridge Mountains. Webb Wright looks at the devastation and the spirit of survival. Black Mountain, one of the hardest hit areas in western North Carolina. You can see with devastation like this and check out the road over here. Flat Creek Road completely washed out. So for a community with no running water, no electricity and no roads, Officials say we're looking at months, maybe even years before life gets back to normal here. No roads. We are trying to get the roads open. No power. More than likely they've told us weeks that we will see power. Water. No water. Water is the most critical thing at this time. Black Mountain is reeling from the effects of Helene, the safety of the community, the main concern. Our next step in the process now that we know where our residents are is to assess our road conditions. People are still trapped in their homes. We know they're there, we know they're okay, but they need to be able to get out at some point. So road clearing, road assessment, and getting a handle on just what exactly the damage is. According to Black Mountain officials, Northwood Reservoir and the town's water systems are both down. The sewage system also down. The plant on French Broad out of service. Officials working to bring alternate resources to the community. Our water system is pretty much non-operational at this point in time, as are many other jurisdictions. Our roads are in bad shape. We've lost lots of bridges. This is going to take years to build back from. Each day gets a little bit better. We get a little more resources in each day. We get a little bit better at planning each day. We get a little bit better and figure out where we're going and what we're doing each day. A community that has worked as hard for its neighbors in need, even with the smallest of things. There's like a lot of people that just don't know how to survive in this kind of situation. So um, coming together as a community has been a beautiful thing. It's the community feel of Americans. You know, this is the American dream. We want to make sure people are successful. We want to try to rebuild and, and make that a reality for the future. Black Mountain officials tell me they will continue to have these informational meetings every day at 3 p.m. at the town square. They will also provide up-to-date information on things like where to get food and water, medical supplies and facilities, and even other resources that the community may need. Here in Black Mountain, Webb Wright will throw it back to you.